I was never really the biggest fan of them, but because I've gotten into these products, let's just face it, plant-based body care is um, starting to ramp up. This is the one that could possibly stain your shower floor, your tub. Oh yeah, I went there. I went there. Oh. Hey guys, just here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be sharing with you guys the best rose scented hygiene products. For those of you that are already a part of the family, I'd like to thank you very much. However, if you are not, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell as well. So without further ado, I will not hold you any longer. Funny thing is about the rose scented products is that I was never really the biggest fan of them, but because I've gotten into these products that I'm going to discuss with you guys, it has turned over a new leaf for me. First things first, we're going in with a plant-based favorite, Rin Pure Rose Water. Just last week, I think, that's when I did a review on this. This is first on the list because let's just face it, plant-based body care is um, starting to ramp up sulfate free and for those of us that have sensitive skin and we're in the sensitive skin club it's a bonus to have something that is plant-based and the less chemicals the better i mean really just because it's plant-based i know there may be some concerns because i had them you know is this still going to be effective it is now this rose water here smells absolutely beautiful it really captures the true essence of what rose water should smell like like the purest form i have tried others which i will discuss one later in this video and it had a tinge a little sample of rose water but it wasn't all the way there and for someone who has never ever smelled rose water before to try something that has that in it a sample of it you should be able to capture the essence of it so this is first on the list i also like how it is look at that clear in the bottle less likely to stain your shower floor less likely to stain your bathtub floor or if you have both you know less likely to stain it all you know this is the one that could possibly stain your shower floor or your tub. Oh yeah, I went there. I went there. I did. Caress rose water and, let me pause, Glanglang oil. This is res best reserved for date night. Whether you have a special someone or for yourself. Okay. Because, you know, you need to take care of yourself and take yourself out and treat yourself. This in itself is a treat, but start your day off with this. Even if you're not going out on a date, you're going to smell like you're going to smell like you're heading to one. Okay. <laughs> I absolutely love this. Now this was formerly called love forever in the black bottle and red print packaging before caress rebranded into this. The only thing I dislike about this is the possible staining of the shower floor or tub floor. So you have to be very cognizant, very aware, very intentional, and very strategic as to how you use this specifically. And body washes that are like this. They're so full of color, they're pearlescent, and this is just a gorgeous crimson red but um bathing with it is a challenge because you don't want it to look like you've been um you've been fighting and you know hit yourself in the nose and you got nose bleed. you don't want to do that you know just be careful with this be careful be careful but it smells incredible and it smells like a very fine perfume so when you use this pair it with something similar from the ogx line the rose water and pink sea salt so this has a sample of what rose water is like, but the full essence isn't there. 
let me explain. So I tried this seven months ago this year and I didn't really like the fact that it was just smelling more salty than anything. I smelled all, almost all of the pink sea salt and it was just, oh my goodness, just crazy. And I'm just like, rose water is supposed to be in this, huh? And then I just put it back on the shelf and I never really touched it again until about a month ago when I did the update, the six month update at the time for this. Now I have a change of heart. Apparently, when you let a product sit on the shelf while you're rotating other products and using them, and you come back to the product, something between it sitting there on the shelf, and also you have to factor in the temperature at which you're storing these items. Store in a cool, dry place, especially body care products. And who knew, letting it sit on the shelf for as long as I did, because I was, at the time, disgusted with it. This is, this, this salty, lightly rose sprinkled stuff. I don't, I ain't with that. That really, honest, I'm being very honest. Until six months later, and I tried it again, and I had a change of heart. So what happened with it sitting on the shelf, it allowed all of the ingredients to mingle together. And now I smell more of the rose water scent than the pink sea salt. The pink sea salt has traveled underneath because of settling in the bottle. It has not gone bad. But now I really get the full essence. I really get the full potency, the fullness of the scent. And I'm like, oh, I like this. Because I wasn't finna throw it away. We're resourceful over here, okay? When I say we're, we are the Brave Squad values. I'm resourceful. Even if I don't like something, I'm gonna find another usage for it to make it work so I get the full value out of it. Yeah, mm hmm Looks like I won't only be letting this sit on the shelf and sparingly using it. Now, another great rose-scented product, and I have ran out of that months months ago first tried it last fall 2020 tree huts and i'll show it on the screen tree hut moroccan rose the shea sugar scrub that's a very beautiful feminine rosy type of floral scent it's not too overpowering and it, it that's another product that captures the true essence of the rose scent you really want to start with something classy and you don't want to do too much when it comes to smelling good, that's the route to go. It really is. So that's definitely a honorable mention. Now, I can't think of anything else that is rose-scented, but that would be the best that I've already tried as I don't want to refer you guys to try something that I've never tried. But that, ladies and gentlemen, is my list of the best rose scented hygiene products that i encourage you guys to try and until next time and until the next video <laughs>